Hey guys, Dr. Dex here. Just wanted to give you a little update on our Cut Hub Chop Saw Station. Uh, I've got it set up right now for doing um, some repetitive cuts. So basically what this is, is it's a material stop. And there's a couple different ways you can use it. One way is if you're into your saw, now the saw's adjustable. We can undo this, undo these two levers right here, and we can shove the whole saw this way if we needed to get this part closer to the blade, okay? But because there's nothing right here, they came up with this kind of ingenious way of uh, making it quick and easy for you so uh, to do multiple repetitive cuts. So you can also pull this off and just completely take it out of the way and store it on board the tool as well. Um, but I thought it was kind of cool and I don't think I've ever shown this. So I just thought I'd give you a quick rundown on it just like that. Now you can make as many cuts at that length as you need to. Then you can adjust it, get your other lengths, whatever. We, we do this quite often. Sometimes we use this part if we're running longer material, we don't need it. We can flip it out of the way, run it all the way to there if we want, or just move this accordingly. And there's also, um, we kind of did a quick and dirty setup, but there's also a ruler built in to each sawhorse, as you can see here. And there's also a indicator line if you set up your saw properly you can actually use this as a measurement tool personally i just use my tape but it's all good and then final thought um, this is their new cam lever system to hold the saw down and it works a lot better than what we've had in the past it really keeps the saw down especially when we're um when we have our material stop Excuse me, especially when we have our material catcher, like our saw, our chop shop around this. And we have our big batteries and we're running a lot of weight on this saw and it's raining. Um, sometimes when I would go like this and I'd let go of the handle, it would want to lift. We don't have that problem anymore with the new setup. So I really applaud CutHub for that. So give them a follow, check them out. CutHub.com.